Charleston Waterkeepers, Granswell PR, and Blue Ion Outpost will screen the new Patagonia film, Blue Heart. Here with us is the leader of Charleston Waterkeepers, Andrew Wonderly, and we're talking first, yeah. what is this movie about? Yeah, Blue Heart's a, a really great film, and, and to be totally candid, I haven't seen it yet, but uh, <laughs> I have seen the trailers, and it's a neat story about uh, an indigenous group of folks who are fighting to protect one of the last wild rivers in continental Europe. And so a lot of the rivers in Europe and even in the United States uh, and here in Charleston have been dammed or ditched or diked or otherwise altered by the hand of man. Mm -hmm. And so uh, these folks are fighting to save the last wild river and the fish that, that swim in it. And uh, if people would like to watch yeah. the trailer or more information <laughs> on tickets, you guys have are all yeah. over social media. Right. I would encourage folks to just go to Charleston Waterkeeper's social media accounts. We're on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram, and, and you really can't miss it once you're there. There's an Eventbrite page set up where folks can uh, purchase a ticket. They're only $5. Uh, it's going to be a really fun evening. We'll, have, uh, we'll be at uh, the Blue Ion down on King Street. Uh, we'll have uh, Groundswell PR. We'll have some fun giveaways. Uh, and then we'll see the film and, you know, enjoy some good company and some good friends and, and talk a little bit about the issues that are impacting our waterways here in Charleston as well. Is this movie so. just to kind of bring awareness yeah. to this problem or is yeah. it helping raise money? Do you, is it making a, do you feel it's making a difference? Right. Yeah, it is a little bit of a fundraiser for us. Okay. Uh, we'll get 100% of the proceeds from the ticket sales. But uh, more importantly, it's to get folks off of social media, out of the digital world, into real life and, and learn about the issues here in Charleston. You know, this story in Blue Heart tells the uh, story of this river in Europe, but we're going to also talk and, and share some information about what's going on right here and how folks can get involved in working to protect their rivers right here in Charleston. So speaking of that, if people yeah. are really inspired by this, yeah. there's tons of volunteer right. opportunities. Yeah. What can people look for? Charleston Waterkeeper is a very active volunteer program, and so what we encourage folks to do is just go to charlestonwaterkeeper.org backslash volunteer, and there's a list of events there, uh, and it's constantly changing. So if, if there's, you know, if you can't make what's there, check back often because it's it's always being updated. Uh, we've got um, we've got a, a big cleanup coming up on March 9th uh, on the Ashley River with the Somerville Saltwater Anglers and, and Dorchester County, Dorchester County Parks and Rec's part of that one. We've got a big oyster recycling event with the Coastal Conservation Association and Low Country Land Trust that's kind of going on behind the scenes at the Low Country Oyster Festival. That's going to be a really fun one. We've got another shell bagging event coming up with the folks at DNR Score. Uh, I did that. That's a lot of fun. It is a lot of fun. <laughs> yeah, it's just it's a neat thing to do. It's it's so physical and tangible, and uh, you know you can see the shell that's going to go back into your creeks and rivers right. to make new oyster beds. It's just it's a fantastic thing to be a part of. Uh, all those events are listed there. All you have to do is go there, check out which ones fit your calendar, sign up, and come out and see us. And, and we're going to do some real good hands. We're going to get your feet wet. We're going to get your hands dirty. We're going to get you sweaty <laughs> and muddy. And, and you're going to go home with a big smile on your face. Absolutely. But it's a great way to get involved in, in conservation and stewardship of your waterways. Absolutely. Thank you so much yeah. for coming in. Uh, hopefully, yeah. we've inspired someone at home to, to get out and make a difference in nature. We'll have all Thank this you. information on our website. Stay with us, guys. I'll have your full forecast coming up on the other side of the break.